The YAL program for me has been a very enriching experience. I didn't just like grow in my skill in like painting and drawing, I also grew as a person. At the beginning of the program, they told us that we would be around a lot of people that were like us. And I really didn't believe them because there aren't really a lot of people like me because I'm different. But I started to talk to people and like realize that there were a lot of people like me and it's really been an awesome experience. At the beginning of the program, my skills weren't as good as anybody else's, I thought. But during the program, the other people taught me what they knew, and I taught them what I knew. I really look forward to doing the program next year, and uh, I would recommend it to anybody who loves art or like feels that's what they want to do. My first year, y'all, was summer of 2017. I was scared on the first day, but I eventually got over it once I get to making friendships and seeing how the whole process works. Y'all is a way to meet other artists in the community who share the same interests as you. You can also learn from those other artists and help build up your own art skills. What I want to do for the rest of my life as a career, as a job, has been on my mind a lot lately. It's very important to me to be a successful woman in life. I consider being a lawyer or a therapist, but I know those professions won't make me as happy as being an artist. Being successful doesn't necessarily mean having some big fancy jobs. Being successful is reaching and accomplishing the goals you set for yourself. Y'all is an eye-opener and an inspiration, and that's how y'all has impacted my life. I'm Emily Mata. I've worked for the Arts Commission for three years. And initially, the game plan was to show up, make my art, and leave. I had no intention of making any kind of friends. I wanted to coast by quietly, under the radar, unnoticed. I wanted to take in the experience with the least amount of human interaction as possible. That was my first year in 2016. This is my third time in the program and two times as a senior apprentice. I was asked to quantify what the Young Artists at Work program has done for me personally or how it's changed me. This is a very difficult question for me to wrap my head around, so allow me to pose some questions to help explain why this particular query is so enigmatic. How does one quantify the thing that changed them into the person they are today? How does one identify what parts of themselves came from where? How does one disconnect all that they've learned over the years from who they are? To break down what Yaw did for me would be to dissect my personality as a whole. What exactly in Yaw made public speaking so easy for me? What exactly in y'all made me unafraid to express myself in the presence of others? What exactly in y'all made challenging myself to go out of my comfort zone in my art, as well as in my everyday life, something I try to do every day? I'm not saying that y'all is the only factor for change in my life. I've grown up with y'all. I started as someone who didn't even think she would pursue a post-secondary career in the arts. Now I've been accepted into the art college of my dreams, and I've been going to school there for about a month. Y'all made me a stronger artist, a stronger person, and a stronger leader. Its impact is present in all parts of my life. I find it easier to articulate myself. I find it easier to teach and to lead after having been trusted in a position of authority for two consecutive summers. I changed from a devoted introvert to an expressive extrovert, and I couldn't be more thankful for that. I find inspiration everywhere now. So I guess what I'm trying to say is that Yaw is more than just painting pictures. Yaw made me fearless. Yaw made me expressive. Yaw made me ambitious. Yaw made me me.